set and racing. Zoe Brand last off the boxes again. Best out wide Corborn Jelly straight across to the lead. Followed up by Yaps the Jewel. Uh, they're followed up on the outside. Starburst Paul getting around the outside of those now. Running on a bit to Spotney. Kevin off the track. Zoe Brand into the straight though and Corborn Jelly races away. Corborn Jelly will beat Yaps the Jewel. They're followed in photos. Starburst Paul and outside of that we had Botney Kevin. After a gap there to Zoe Brand there. Followed further back Belfast Susie all against me. And uh, that was one of the last there with half a meal. Ready. And racing. Corbombo fairly away. Best out would have been Claremont Diva. Uh, they followed going up and around the outside. Chockty Ellis, another one coming around as Lant Fontaine has grabbed the lead. They followed further back the field by Mulberry Brook. Now Corbombo's well back as they turn for home here and getting away. La Fontaine. La Fontaine will beat Chockty Ellis. They followed by Claremont Diva. Along the inside, Mulberry Brook. They followed by Quattro. Out wider still, what I like, B. Oste. Uh, G. Corbon Boat, disappointing. That was back near the tail of the field, and Mulberry Brook would have been back there as well. Set and racing. Blue Gale Rise uh, hopped away okay today. It's going to dive through on the inside and try and grab the lead but more speed from Noble Fantasy out wide. They're followed flirt with me. Now back behind those runners along the inside TV Gidget out wide is still Red Eye Max into the straight though and Noble Fantasy's kicked away. Noble Fantasy flirt with me up for third Red, Red Eye Max then we've got Corborn Porsche. Further back there to Blue Gale Rise outside that home where she main pulling up last there TV Gidget. Remember of course the late scratching of Billy West. Ready and racing and the field away Harlem Hark is away nicely now showing up there we've got on the outside of par where Chris has got nice and handy they're followed up on the outside by Z Broger back on the inside three lengths back Vinny Baxter Casino Black about midfield he's got about seven lengths to make up he'll start moving in a moment they're followed back we go along the inside there to Sheldon Baxter and then the rest are headed further back there by Homewish Marlow on the corner Harlem Hark has got away here and down the outside Casino Black's winding up he's coming quick Quickly. Oh, I think he's just missed. Harlem Harker, Casino, Black and Power, Chris. They're followed by Homeless Marlowe. Further back, Z Broger. They're followed by Vinny Baxter. And towards the tail, Sheldon Baxter. And racing off the inside, she's a gambles away brilliantly. Followed up then, uh, moving up now on the outside or getting through KD8 at near the rail and coming around the outside. Smash rumor up there, they're followed by Onesie. Little gap, the others headed further back by KD8, but up they come. She's a gamble favourite all the way, will beat Smash rumor. Onesie got home for third after a gap of four to home was Noz. They're followed out wider still by Quiet Snort. Now back behind those KD8 at Marmalulu never got into the race today. And back there towards the tail, Quiet Snort and Bellasconi. Ready. 
and racing. Field away out wide, Starburst Benny's away smartly, followed out by Blushing Bell. Jeff made a great beginning today. Blushing Bell, Gay Thorley running third at the moment, gets the rails run. They're followed after a gap of two to Bank Roller, getting around the outside of that calm spirit. Two and a half back there to Wagon Will, and out the back is a power Cassidy. The leader, Starburst Benny. Blushing Bell could be a threat, starting to close on the leader now as they turn the corner. And the Starburst Benny trying to hold, but Blushing Bell getting over the top. Blushing Bell doing the better. Blushing Bell beats Starburst Starburst Benny, then Bank Roller, further back Calm Spirit. They're followed by Wagon Wheel. Gay Thorley dropped out and towards the tail there of Power Cassidy. And racing, Mulberry Caddo slow, best out wide on the track, Corborn Herdo. Down on the inside, driving through now, Slingo, and coming around the outside, Emily Patrick. Now the rail opening up from Mulberry Caddo. They're followed three lengths back, Joyful, further back, Party Rock into the straight, Corborn Herdo, and down the outside, Emily Patrick, Corborn Herdo. Corborn Herdo beat Emily Patrick. Then in the photo, Joyville might have just noticed out Slingo, that's close. Then Mulberry Caddo followed down on the inside there by Party Rock, and the last couple full of pride and licorice whip. And racing, Baby James stepped away slowly. Best out would have been Hustler Ambition, but going up wide, Idle Girl has got the pace to go up and around the outside and will grab the lead. They're followed back third there by running Jonah. Round the outside, a length and a half back, Bizarro. They're followed well back there by No Solution. Outside of that, now running South, there's a gap of four back, a par with Chill, and Baby James is five back last. Something's got to miss with her. On the corner, and the leader is Idle Girl and trying hard, Hustler Ambition, but Idle Girl, Idle Girl. A length and a half hustler ambition. They're five in front of the others. Thrilling Jonah might have sneaked through for third. They're followed up on the outside. No solution. Now back behind those runners uh, would have thrilling sound of power chill. They're followed uh, towards the tail. Uh, Baby James now. It's pulled up some distance back behind them. Baby James. Green light through, Bunny set a motion, set to jump, ready. And racing. Corbon dashes away nicely and Fat Pants going up on the outside to join it. Uh, they're followed three lengths away now by getting around Jumping Sally. Back behind those is Carla Repeater out very wide. Candy Bell around the corner. Corbon Dasher, Fat Pants the outside, but Corbon Dasher got home. Corbon Dasher, favourite wins it from Fat Pants and five back uh, Jumping Sally. After those, Carla Repeater. Outside of that was Black Tank. They're followed by Candy Bell. Now, don't call me, never got into it. And that was back with Pandora Doll. Set and racing. Field away, best out or no future jump well, but uh, heading to the front here is Lock and Var Camaro and going around the outside. McJopton showing a bit, but Lock and Var Camaro's the leader. Round the turn out of the straight, getting the uh, getting around and was out back Bill, running some sort of a race and through on the inside of Power Pearl. No future poise just behind them. Favourite draws away though as they come to the bend, and it's Lock and Var Camaro about three in front. Then a Power Pearl getting along the inside. No future starting to rock at home, but in front is Lock and Var Camaro 
Rose done the job nicely. Then no future. Three back of Power Pearl. They're followed out wide by McJobson. Now right in that bunch, Law to Excel. They're followed back by Moon and C. And out back Bill uh, after showing up early towards the tail there with a Power Cuddles. And racing down on the inside of Hoka Taylor jumped out. What a line early. Out wide, Corbon Polly explodes across and hits the front from Noggin. That's nice and handy. They're followed by Paddy Baxter in third spot. A couple of lengths away, they were followed by a Pawanetti. There's a gap of five to the others. Stitch up heads them. Well back then to Mulberry Hunter and out the back of the field is uh, going to be Corp is going to be uh, rather Hoka Taylor on the corner though. Doing it nicely here. Corbon Polly, it's got a big lead. They're not going to catch it. Corbon Polly beat Noggin. They followed Paddy Baxter. After those, the Power Natty that was three lengths back, then Stitch Up. They followed Big Gap, the others, headed by No Taste. That never got into it. Mulberry Hunter and a Hoka Taylor is wound up at the tail. Ready. And racing, field away and jumping nicely, Fireman's Legacy and the other favourite could toot up on the outside. They're followed three lengths away, coming around now we've got Wandy Feather, they're followed by Gypsy Hunter, they've straighted the others well back, Y Mac Dave out wider here, 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 but up they come, Fireman's Legacy and fun will beat could toot, then Gypsy Hunter third, after those we had Wandy Feather down on the inside, Y Mac Dave, then Pep's Pot, and the last couple, Karama's Girl and here, here, here.